How do you guys deal with depression? Sometimes I don't realize I'm depressed, until I'm in the middle of a depressive episode. I made a depressive episode kit for myself. Sometimes I can't bring myself to shower or wash my face, so I buy face wipes, body wipes, dry shampoo and conditioner. A lot of people may find it gross, but when you're at your worst they come in handy. I have a candle to help bring comfort. Sometimes I find myself unable to brush my teeth, so mouthwash is a part of the kit. Something to fidget with, easy snacks and food, that take no preparation. It's not the most sustainable thing, but I switch to paper plates, to keep dishes from piling up, because seeing them tends to make me spiral. Fistfuls of mushrooms. When I could afford it, I was in therapy once a week. My therapist offered me a ton of useful websites and books to read, when I was unable to continue, because I lost my insurance. Basic psychology textbooks gave me the tools I needed to explore deeper psychology, which in turn, led me to a deeper understanding, of what was actually causing my depression. Turns out it had nothing to do with my second wife cheating on me. These days, whenever I feel myself slip, I find my way back to notes I took several years ago, and that helps me through. Education in why your brain works the way it does, can be a very powerful ally to combat depression. Come to the realization, that you are probably depressed, because of the system you are forced to live in. If that is the case, understand that it is not you, that is the problem and find the strength within yourself to accept yourself for what you are, and use your power, to find your rhythm with the universe, work towards goals, that are your own and important for you, not status, not a career, not a model family etc. Don't judge yourself by these things, and don't let the voices of people, that don't really care about you matter in any way, you will break through. Focus on who you are becoming. Keep on keeping on, reminds me of what Jim Carrey said, depression is your body saying screw you, I don't want to be this character anymore, I don't want to hold up this avatar, that you've created in the world, it's too much for me, you should think of the word back quote depressed as back quote depressed, your body needs to be depressed, it needs depressed from the character, that you've been trying to play. Exercise. Statistically in USA, which is the most overdiagnosed country in the world, exercise is as much effective, if not more effective to treat depression than SSRIs, since it helps you build a serotonin in baseline without the negative side effects. Thank you abnormal psychology class, I also game, smoke, and socialize as much as possible. Stay in the present, gardening, taking a walk, call a friend. Spend time with animals, chickens make remarkably entertaining pets, seek therapy, having goals and taking some action toward them helps move forward in the bigger picture. Lay in bed with very loud music blasting from my headphones, while restraining myself from checking the social media of people I used to know, as a man who has been conditioned by society to believe crying is wrong for a man I have a hard time being in touch with my emotions, as a result, despite wanting to cry and let it all out I physically can't, all my emotions stay bottled up inside, and it stresses me out even more, so usually I'm just choked up for the majority of my day thinking about how I want to kill myself, but I'm too scared to do it. Weightlifting cardio helps, playing at the local gym even 1v1 gets you involved in the community, and makes you feeling better about yourself, and eat regularly, eat good nutritious meals, and not crap processed foods. Be nice to yourself, and judge yourself introspectively. They hate me me to me, who told you that? It's probably been discussed, but therapy helps. Get one you'll connect with, if the connection is not there it's just makes it worse. Go through a couple, if you have to find the right one. I get depressed due to the fact, that I take a lot on myself. I want too much in this life, and sometimes at some point I break down. Then I try to calm down, and put things off, to free my head. Recently in my city there was shelling by terrorists and the internet was turned off for 3 days. And you can imagine how life has stopped. There are no messages and calls. Everything is calm and quiet, but there is a possibility that they will break into you and shoot you. Schedules help not just for work, but for most everyday things. Start with making your bed. After you get up, eat healthier foods. Do yoga in the morning 20 minutes. Go to the gym 3 times a week at least. Talk to people I know it's hard with covid going around. But go to the bar have a few just connect with people. 
goes a lot further than you think. Daily workout routine and healthy diet are at the top of the list. Obviously when depression sets in, those become harder, because everything does. When that happens, I just go through the motions with both as best I can. Discipline is action without motivation and that comes in handy. Additionally, I try to sprinkle in my hobbies throughout the week, to give me something to look forward to. Just be careful, since some hobbies can be frustrating at times, which could further exacerbate negative feelings. When you're down in it, connecting with others is vital too. Some days that's just going to the gym or grocery stores and others it's dinner with your soul or friends. Ultimately, I found my success with dealing with depression comes from an ability to run on autopilot to avoid having a zero day. When times get rough, then when things let up, you have momentum to embrace the joy and further build your resiliency. Psilocybin or your psychedelic of choice please. If you've never done them be careful as for certain mental illnesses psychedelics are contraindicated. Meditation, pets, serving others, being helpful, working chores, paring down to-do lists, showing love to those I care about in their love language, showing love to those I care about in my love language. I avoid addictive activities and avoid things that will take time away from the above listed things so that I don't add guilt or feelings of regret to fuel the depression. Realize what it is and just get through the day. Just try to stay positive and appreciate the good things in your life. Depression used to come at me in waves. In other words, you'll have some good days followed by one or two bad ones. Over time I'll learn to accept and love myself, flaws and all. This was the biggest turnaround for me. I haven't been depressed in quite some time. Also eating better and working out help a lot. Just be willing to do the work to improve, not fix. You are not broken, yourself. Remember you're a person, and perfection is an unobtainable goal. But you can always strive to do better than the day before. Take it one day at a time, and sometimes you need a day, where you just let yourself feel like sh**, do nothing, and veg out. It sucks because dealing with depression can be a full-time job by itself. Working out can help stave it off temporarily too. Day to day, force yourself to do things, and feel proud you accomplish them. On your worst day it's a triumph to get out of bed, and make yourself some food or just pick up your place a little. Most importantly, be kind to yourself. I just isolate myself completely for a few days, just standing up to go to the toilet and not eating, nor drinking anything, while sleeping at least 10 hours. And depending on how bad I'm feeling I also stop going to school. Sometimes I force myself to socialize, to go out, and talk to friends. What oftentimes results in my social battery being burned out completely after an hour or so. Not to mention all the masking in front of others. Oh and before I forget to mention that the realization going on basically Jesus take the wheel. I'll be idk where, but not present. I have struggled with this for a long time. I'm not quite sure if I'm clinically depressed, but there is definitely something wrong. I'm an alcoholic. I binge drink for a few days in a row about once a month. I have never stayed sober long enough to see if that would cure my symptoms. If anything I became much more depressed after 90 days sober. But back to my answer. I lift weights and take very long walks in nature. <laughs>